But now to the chaotic scene in Chicago, an explosive crash when a stolen SUV smashes into the back of a truck that bursts into flames. The carjackers manage to get out and run away. Julian Cruz from our Chicago affiliate WGN explains what happened next. Chicago police rushing in on the suspects in Lincoln Square after a frantic morning. They took CPD to a pair of north side neighborhoods, culminating with a fiery crash. It was pretty crazy. I mean, this is a real quiet neighborhood. And, you know, it's scary. It's scary. Jamie Alvarado jolted out of his apartment near Oakley and Winona. Just uh, came out and then boom, it started blowing and blowing. My dogs just startled. So we had to go to the corner because the policeman said, come on, let's get out of the way. Witnesses spotting four men jumping out of a burning Hyundai SUV after it collided with the streets and sanitation truck. The Hyundai, according to investigators, a stolen vehicle. The wild scene shortly after a group of men, also in an SUV, tried to carjack a silver sedan in nearby Ravenswood, and just minutes later, the collision with the truck in Lincoln Square. One of our neighbors, I guess, tipped him off and said that uh, they thought that they might be hiding back there. Police, within the hour, zeroing in on the suspects just a half a block from the crash site. WGN News photographer Ray Ruiz following patrol officers and tactical units as they corner the suspects, apparently hiding in a garage. Four men taken into custody by Chicago police. 40th Ward Alderman Andre Vasquez says communication was the key. Because neighbors were in communication with each other, they had um, some of the home cameras up and were able to communicate to CPD. Oh, that was Julian Cruz reporting. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.